Okay, welcome back. <laughs> run, run number six. Uh, my tire loses a little bit of air pressure daily in PSI. If they each begin with 32 PSI and lose 0 0.02 PSI per day, which equation would dig the data where X represents the number of days and F of X represents the PSI. So we're starting with how much? 32. Uh, plus 32 somewhere, or positive 32. And then we're subtracting out this per day. Subtracting that out, and we're starting with 32. How about B? Yeah. Any questions on that? All right, number seven. Nicole wants a cell phone that costs $70 with a monthly payment of $40 a month. So we're starting with how much? $70. So we're starting with $70, and then it's going to cost an additional $40 every month. Is uh, B. 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 Right, both positive, right? Both expensive. Good. Number eight. Which table rule describes the data in the table? Mm -hmm. Same as before. Look at the y's. What's the difference in the y's? The add is the y. Plus three. Oh, plus three. Yeah. Plus three. Yeah. Plus three. So that's going to be our slope. So I can eliminate A and B, yeah? Because the slope on A and B is 1. And now let's plug them in. Let's plug in a 5. Oh, I'm sorry, we've got to plug the x's in. Plug in a 2. 2 times 3 is 6. Minus 1 gives us 5. That one works. Let's try plug in a 4. 3 times 4 is 12. Minus 1 gives us 11. It's C. It's C, right? Oh. Is everything all right? Yeah. Okay. All right, number nine. So Tyree is rollerblading in front of a motion detector. His move is graphed below. Use the following motion graph to answer the following questions. So what's the y-axis say? Why does it say that this is from? Distance from the detector? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so say at this point, he is three feet from the detector, right? And that's at four seconds of skating, right? Mm -hmm. Bottom is time. Okay? So he is walking toward the motion detector in segments. So when is he getting closer to the detector? Uh, up at C. So from seconds four to eight, he's going from three feet away to four feet away. He's getting farther away, isn't he? Mm -hmm. As time passes, he's getting far. The higher we are, the farther he is from the detector, right? So it would be D then. No. no. From eight to ten seconds, he goes from four feet away all the way to nine feet away. He's getting farther away. Which one's he getting closer to? Uh, B. B, right? From two seconds to four seconds, he goes from being seven feet away to three feet away. So B. And he's standing still in which segment? A. That's A, right? He stays seven feet away for a couple seconds. He's moving away from the detector. B. And? B. C. C and D, right? He changes direction between segments blank and segments blank. Changes direction. C and D. C and D is still going away from it. He's just at D is going away faster. B and C. B and C, right? B is going towards it, and then C is going away from it. What? He's standing still for how many seconds? Two, Two seconds. Two seconds? Mm -hmm. Segment A has a rate of Two. feet per second. Two feet per second. Segment A. Seven feet. Uh, he's staying. He's not changing at all, right? Oh, it's zero. Man. Zero, right? Yeah, zero. He's not moving. Well, like segment B that we talked about. Think about what's the slope of a horizontal line. 
slope of a horizontal line. That's also zero. Okay? When they're asking for rate, that's slope. Uh, segment B has a rate of. What is it, negative three? Segment B has a rate of. It would definitely be negative. Let's see, how many feet does he go for? One, two, three, four feet yeah. in two seconds. So four divided by two? Two. Two. But we know it would be negative, right? Negative. Negative. That's a definite negative slope. Four plus seven B. Do what? Four seven B. B is negative two. C, segment C. Four. Rise over run. On, over, three. one, two, three, four, it looks like. Oh. Right? And then D, rise, one, two, three, four, five, over, one, two. So five halves. Joggers, Arnie, Bernice, and Carl have their distance from home graphed below. Distance from home. So the higher the graph, the farther they are away from home. Answer true or false for each question. True or false, Arnie's graph is the steepest. True. True. Yeah. True. So steep is going high. Yeah, the steep this would be straight up and down. Yeah. Carl is the slowest jogger. False. False. Or, look how far he got from his house. It's one, two, three, four, five. So we'll say this is meat. Oh, we'll, we'll say this is. It's because of the distance. Mean, yeah, but look how much time it took. The direction he took. Actually, he didn't even run that far. Oh, so Look how far he is from the house. He's only one, two, three, four, five miles. And it took him that long. But look how far away Artie is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine miles away. It only took him that long. Mm -hmm. so definitely oh, Carl's the uh, slowest. True. Yeah, the farther you go to the right, that's just time. you got to go up. I and graph to go far away. Bernice is faster than Arnie. False. False. They ran the same distance, but it took her longer. And the joggers are moving away from home. True. True. Any questions on 6 through 10? Okay.